What's going on guys? FunTampa.com. Tampa Bay is awesome. Here on the Hillsborough River on the Freedom Boat Club about to explore the Hillsborough River. Well, welcome to a day in the bay. We're going to take you from Fort DeSoto up to Clearwater, back over to Tampa and St. Pete and all around Tampa Bay. Five picks, day in the bay. So before my first pick, make sure you check out Freedom Boat Club. This is amazing guys. It's March. We're on the boat. Hillsborough River just enjoying it and giving you our of course favorites for the day in the bay this week all right so number one since we're on the Hillsborough River get on the pirate taxi take a nice cruise around stop at different places enjoy the beautiful water that this amazing city has to offer and go check out the pirate taxi All right guys, take a journey with me. We're gonna take the Pirate Water Taxi up and down Tampa. It's an amazing time, an hour long. The best part is Bud Light Seltzer. Fun Tampa, Pirate Water Taxi, Bud Light Seltzer. Let's ride. I did mention they have a bar, right? Make sure you get on there. It was an awesome ride. I took it back and forth. Great times. They even have alcohol. Joe, what's your pick? All right, everybody. So we're going to go to one of my favorite spots in St. Pete. It's healthy. It's delicious. It's the first place that I ever had one of these sushi burritos. You have got to check out Pacific Counter if you have not been there yet. Check out this video. Now, there is no shortage of deliciousness all around St. Pete, but I have got to say that Pacific Counter is one of the places that I think I could go eat every single day and never get bored i mean the the rolls are fantastic they just launched these amazing hot dogs that are hawaiian style hot dogs they are so so tasty obviously you can never go wrong with the bowl go check them out if you've never been there they're over at 660 uh, central avenue in saint pete absolutely fantastic and they just opened up another location in lakewood ranch check it out all right, Captain, keep this boat going. We're going to go to St. Pete and go get that burrito right now. But until we get down there, let's jump back over to Karen for his next pick. Okay, so before I say my next spot, look at this. Look at this UT. Where was this when we all wanted to go to school? This is ridiculous. These kids are living the best life in a day in the bay. So my next choice is Fort DeSoto. The whole thing. Fort DeSoto is amazing. If you've never been there, you can just go relax. You can actually see the Skyway Bridge. It's a beautiful picture of the Skyway Bridge. Horseback riding, fishing, beach, bike riding. Fort DeSoto is amazing. Check it out. So thank you guys so much. Fort DeSoto is amazing. Please check it out. Also, you can find me going back to school at Rodney Dangerfield. I'm going to UT. This is the most amazing college. Joe, just give him one more. I'm going to be over here uh, enrolling. All right, everyone, on to my next pick. We're going to take a ride over to Clearwater Beach and go to the place that is my go-to for before, during, or after, whatever time of day it is. I love going to Coco's Crush because one, it's outdoors. They got tasty little bites. Check this place out. Welcome to Coco's Crush over at 317 Coronado Boulevard over in St. Pete. This that you're witnessing right now is the Crush drink. Absolutely tasty, but this is just one of my favorite places to go hang out over at Clearwater Beach. It is just off the sand right behind the Hyatt, and it's just great because it's simple. Great little bar bites, great little cheap drinks, great cocktails, super fun time all outdoors they've got a little inside area if you really wanted to hang out but frozen drinks 
buckets of beer. What else could you ask for when you are going to the beach to hang out? So if you've never been over there, make sure to go check out Coco Crushes over on 317 Coronado. All right, everyone, if you love outdoor spots, we're gonna jump over to Karen and see the amazing place that he is about to feature. So guys, thank you so much for joining us in Day in the Bay. We're gonna end it right here. My last pick, the Freedom Boat Club. We're on one of their boats. Their locations are everywhere through Tampa. Harbor Island, Ricks on the River, Gibsonton, St. Pete Clearwater. And look at this. You get to experience what Tampa has to offer. The beautiful waterfronts, the restaurants, the boaters, the jet skiers, the dolphins. We've seen a lot of dolphins today. So you gotta experience Tampa. That's why we bring you a day in the bay. Please take our advice and go to these places because they're amazing. Definitely check out Freedom Boat Club. Get a boat. Come check it out. It's amazing. I'm gonna keep saying amazing because 